Start off giving your name. Okay, my name is Jenny Rabe, and I am the evening worker in Jackson Library, and I tend to work in three departments while I'm here. The reference desk, the circulation desk, and when I have some free time off the desk in cataloging. So that makes you a jack of all trades for the library. Yes, I learned in library school that it was very advantageous to be a generalist. And so, so you can diversify in the long run and, you know, yes. guarantee a job as opposed to just knowing one thing, which sometimes, you know, library science students, we get into one thing and we don't study other aspects. Um, you came to Germany, uh, to the United States in what year? In 1969. In 1969. During the Cold War, yes. Have you been in Greensboro the entire time? In the general area, yes. Okay, that's mm -hmm. good. Um, now I understand, um, before you got your library science degree, you went ahead and had some other degrees, is that correct? Yes, I have a degree in German, a BA in German and political science and philosophy. And I also have a master's degree in history and almost a master's degree in German. So you could call me a lifelong student. Yeah, during all those degrees, what, at what point did you decide you were going to pursue library science? At the point of getting the degree in philosophy, which I enjoyed very, very much, but other than standing on the street corner, um, it would not provide me with much of a job. Yeah. So chose being a taxi driver school. wasn't a long-term career exactly. interest. Exactly. And I've always loved libraries, in particular Jackson Library, since I have studied here so much over the years for my degrees. I have always loved this library, and it's always been a secret wish of mine, oh, if I could get a job in this library, that would be wonderful. Do you have a favorite position in a library that you work? I can't really say. I love them, all three departments. For different reasons. For different like, reasons. Yeah. I love the public service desks, both in reference and the circulation desk, because I love working with the students and helping people. And I am an extrovert by nature. I love people and being with people. But then, at times, it's also nice to catalog the German books. It's a little nostalgic for me. It's wonderful to keep up with the latest German books coming in. And I get to use my analytical skills, which I have, and I do have those, and I like to get things perfect. And so, it's a nice balance. So it's As you have your uh, master's in history, I figured I'd ask you, um, as our last question before we wrap up, unless you have anything you feel you would really like to add, um, as it's your time here on the screen, um, who is your favorite historical figure and why? Okay. I just happened to be cataloging a biography of this man, and he's always been one of my... I can't say he's my the most favorite when you're very partial one of to, the top yeah. on the top uh, Gandhi for one yeah. but this man is called Willy Bunt and he was the Chancellor in Germany uh, at the time of the Cold War at the time that the wall was built in Berlin and I am from Berlin and I saw whereas the Soviets at first said the city was divided you can't call your relatives you can't send them anything you can't go across the wall and visit neither this way nor neither east nor west it was Willy Bunt as a chancellor and he received the Nobel Peace Prize for this that bit by bit bought the Berlin Wall down before it actually came down all those years he would send like a million marks hard west marks to the east and say okay we give you this money let the people call each other on the phone and they said let the people come visit each other at Easter another million marks. So he he really helped the tragic situation of the Berlin Wall and I too had family in the East and it was it was nice and it was all thanks to Willy Bunt wow, and that's, his policies. That's amazing. I, I because when just as a historian the person who tends to get the most credit at least here in the US is, is Helmut Kohl so it's very interesting you've uh, enlightened me uh, and I guess obviously other people uh, to Willy Brandt.